what do you mean it's not Halloween? Because I just witnessed Tammy Slayton sticking her tongue down the throat of the you king. And that was some scary you see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Get up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. This video is sponsored by me and my protein donut company and my weight loss support group. For more information, click the links below in my description and thank you all for the support. You guys, I feel like Dog the Bounty Hunter's wife with the up to my face, but also kind of like. <gasps> I lost a Dale. I didn't even notice. Took me forever to put these on and the pinky freaking pops off like we're about to. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. It's another fat chick video and we're talking about BBW King. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel where every day is Halloween. My dogs are my minions and they do my bidding horribly and while farting, mostly Yoshi. And we talk about a variety of topics, but today's topic is BBW. King and Tammy Slayton being back together. It must be April Fool's Day, I don't know, but ever since I got on TikTok, follow me. You guys have been tagging me in a man of royalties page. Philip, AKA the BW King, the king of big, beautiful women. Come, 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 sit around the fire. It's Halloween. Let me tell you a story. Let's be like the kids from Are You Afraid of the Dark? Sitting around the fire, sharing Tells? Well, let me tell you a tell, a love story, if you will, of two distant lovers who came together. Their relationship is full of drama, manipulation, lies, and lust, all things we love to talk about. Sir Philip, a self-proclaimed king, king of the BBWs from the world of TikTok, and Queen Tammy has traveled to the world of TikTok, but the voluptuous queen is from a land called TLC. She has helped build that kingdom just by eating and gaining weight. Her town grew because people from everywhere was enamored and infatuated by how big the Queen Tammy could get. This is getting weird, huh? <laughs> Welcome to the channel, subscribe. Well, eventually the two found each other. How could they not? B King loves big, beautiful women and Tammy, a woman that to him is beautiful and is on a show called 1000 Pound Sister, soon to be the 1000 Pound Woman. TikTok had brought the two together. It was fate until one day, the town doctor told Tammy, if you do not change your eating habits, you will fall to sickness and die. I'm worried about Tammy. I'm afraid that the longer this goes, your mobility is gonna go away. As soon as you can't walk, that's gonna be the end of the fruit. But this did not frighten the Queen Tammy, no. The townspeople loved her weight. And more importantly, the king absolutely was enamored by her weight. He did write in the scrolls that the bigger the better, 300 or more is what he likes and prefers. Well, one day the doctor's words fell true and Queen Tammy fell into a deep sleep. The facility had called and told me Tammy had took a what, turn for the worst. The townspeople thought that they had lost Queen Tammy forever because she was not waking up. They're just telling us that her lungs have given up, and like her body is shutting down. So at this point, you know, we're, we're, we're facing making funeral arrangements for my little sister. But magically, with no kiss, the Queen Tammy opened her eyes and arose from her slumber. Tammy the Queen knew she must follow what the doctor says and lose weight, but this angered the king. I broke up with Philip because I started him getting mad over every little thing. Queen Tammy wanted to be a better person, but this left a sour taste in the BW King's mouth. Philip's different, for example. I didn't want to eat. I wanted to better myself. Queen Tammy eventually broke her relations with the king and sent him back to the realm of TikTok to do his dances and mouth his words. The cold water cut the stove on straight aside, bitch. This angered the king. How dare you defy and send away the king of BWs? No, no one does that. So he began harassing Queen Tammy. This weekend was a roller coaster of emotions. My ex-boyfriend has been harassing me. I've got the police involved. And something you need to know about the BW King is that he does not like the word no. He does not like being ignored, and he most definitely does not like these two combined and coming from a BW because he is the king of them. 
It's in his name. How dare Queen's have me not bow to the king? And so he had his fellow subjects get in contact with her. In an hour, he called 20 times at least. And when I wouldn't answer his call, he called me on a private number. And when I wouldn't answer that, he had his friends call. And why was the BW King flustered, angered, irritated? Apparently, Queen Tammy had another king fluffing her feathers in her carriage. Why am I making this fairy tale when I'm dressed as a clown? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Nothing makes sense. The king is back in the picture, so we're just going with it. All this started because I'm being seen in a video with another person, and he's freaking out about it. He said I'm publicly embarrassing him. Well, all the calls from the king and his subjects only increased the stress the anxiety from Queen Tammy, and she began to eat. In the last few days, I've given up on my diet. Well, more stress began to come into Queen Tammy's world. For as B.W. King proclaimed war on the land of TLC, along with Queen Tammy herself, and he said that they will ride on their horse and throw down the kingdom's doors. He told me he was gonna be here. He just bust through my door. I'm scared. And y'all would love to think that this is the end of the story, right? Someone like the B W King with his obvious anger issues and controlling issues. Tammy, who is someone that is extremely addicted to food, really wants love and affection, can't seem to find it from anyone, and B W King is there to influence these horrible behaviors. She would probably want to stick around with a guy like the King because, you know, She's probably quite horny. But unfortunately, the two bring these very intense and unhealthy feelings together. Probably the best thing that they stay apart. Keep their distance, right? Story over. Screen ghosts of black. <laughs> We're dealing with reality television and people who love to be in the limelight. Well, apparently they are back together via TikTok. The man that influenced her eating habits got upset when she was trying to be better and said that he's going to forcibly knock down her doors is back in her life. And they are in love and better than ever. Sounds like a future show. Tammy and her king, back and better than ever. And apparently we, me, you, Yoshi, Rigby, and Butters are all the stupid ones for believing what we saw on TLC. You really believe scripted TV? Ha! <laughs> Just got off the phone with her. Love you, baby. First of all, those last clips I used, those were from Tammy's personal YouTube page. They were a video that she filmed in her house. So what is it, Philip? Is Tammy's channel scripted? Was that special effects, Philip? Well, people were saying, dude, you're weird. Tammy's done with you. Give it up. You're fake. You probably don't even like fat women, which he responded to. He really don't love them 300 or bigger. He just using them. So he pretty much just dances around to music saying, you guys don't understand. I can't show you the music, but I'll just uh, mouth it for you from what I think the song's saying. Y'all don't know nothing about me. I love fat women, don't you see? Pretty much. People were saying, we all know you don't really love Tammy. You're just in it for the TV. Well, he had something to say about that. TikTok style, of course. One thing I can't fake is love. And then he said, you're just trying to get clout from Tammy. Leave her alone, stalker. We saw the video. And then he posted somebody's hand, somebody's chubby ass hand. And people were like, God damn it, Tammy. Tammy, is this you? Tammy, are these your fat fingers? Cause we've been trying to stick up for you. And this looks like your, your hand. It's Tammy, Lord help her. Ugh, he gonna be on the next season. I love you, Philip. So then it was Tammy, it was confirmed. Especially with the next video he posted, I'm just gonna play it completely all the way through so that you can feel whatever you're gonna feel while watching it. Hit it. Just look at his face at the end. The end is for that lady that commented. What's her name? Baby Dill 313 who said that he's gonna be on the next season and he's like you're damn right I'm gonna be on the next season cuz this bitch dumb as hell So apparently he traveled to see her remember when she was saying that she was gonna travel to see him and everyone was like Uh, you can barely walk to the mailbox or the car or the bathroom How are you gonna travel your ass to Las Vegas? So uh, he traveled to go see her 
better option. The love I have for you, I will go anywhere for you. All very sweet, right? Anyway, I found it very interesting when I went to his profile and TikTok gave me a little warning. Participating in this activity could result in you or others getting hurt. And I agree, a man that has a morbidly obese, we can't use the F word, uh, appreciation for sickly, almost dead, obese women who have issues, and then going there to visit said sickly, obese woman who has a lot of food issues, and having his slogan be 300 pounds or more, the bigger the better, he likes him very big, very able to squish him and suffocate him, and obviously a F-E-E-D-E-R. Yes, that situation can be very hurtful to other obese women who are very easy to manipulate, like the you king is doing to certain people but also don't be thinking that i'm saying tammy is the victim she is not she knows damn well at this point everybody has told her this is this is her decision and she's a grown ass woman a grown ass big woman that can make her own decision but yes i do think the situation is very dangerous because there's many people that can be easy manipulated and really want love and these people will see that they're insecure and will give them love. They'll even travel across the country to go see them because of love, not for their own personal enjoyment to get squished. I personally don't recommend anyone that has a binge eating disorder to get involved with anyone that gets off on feeding them. You hear that fat women everywhere? My fat sisters, my beautiful big women, anyone out there that's listening, maybe men, I don't know what, what he's into, who knows, but everyone listening, okay, this man, right here, warning, don't date him. He's going to influence bad behaviors. I just felt like I needed to warn everybody, unlike some people who say that they love you, save your life, don't end up with him. But they are doing great, according to the W King, everything scripted, the show, what Tammy said in her own house when she was filming on her YouTube channel, and they even watched the show together. I don't care what the world thinks, that's my baby. So much so, I'll call her over 20 times in a few minutes and then beat down her door when she tells me she doesn't want to be with me. Love will make you do crazy things. So Tammy, I wish you the best. I don't think you're making the best choices, to be completely honest, but you are a grown woman. I hope the weight loss continues. I know you had that scare where you almost died, so that was intense. But you know, congrats. You got a man that holds money up to the camera so that everyone knows that he's got all the monies. Ooh, for a switch up. I hit the function, hit the rose. What a score. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex on. Neighborhood all 